When talking about object-orientated programming, and in fact some procedural programming as well, you may have come across the term scope. Scope is all about how accessible something is. For example, if the scope is global, that means it's accessible throughout the entire program. You can create global variables, for example, inside memory, and it doesn't matter where in the program you are, you can still access those and use them. Other times, the scope may be local, local to a single method or function. When that's the case, that variable, whatever it is you may have created, only has local scope and only exists inside RAM while that piece of code, that functional method, is actually running. As soon as that function finishes, that piece of memory is reclaimed. It also means that outside of that one method, you cannot actually see that variable. Uh, a good example of this is if you imagine a room, and in the front of that room you have a bouncer. So at the door of the room you have a bouncer. Now something that's global can pass in and out throughout that room, but something that's local is actually trapped inside that room and the bouncer won't let them out. This room has no windows so no one can see in, and no one can access that person, and no one knows that person even exists, except if you are in that room with that person.